Hi guys, welcome back to my channel Steady B. Here we are with another lesson of maths and this chapter is known as shape. Do you know what is a shape? Okay, don't worry if you don't know, we are going to learn. Okay, the shape is an outline of something. Okay, the outline of can be of your um, can be of your water bottle, can be of your pencil, can be of your uh, television, can be of your mobile phone, can be of your book. So everything or everything in your home or everything that you are using have some kind of outline. So every outline have the name according to their category. What is the outline of your pencil? Or if I say what is an outline of your coin? If you have a coin in your home, just take the coin and sit and uh, realize it and see it. What is the shape of your coin? So we are going to learn over here. So the important shapes are some of our here. Circle, square, rectangle so circle is the shape like this it have no sides it is of the round shape so if you take your one your number one finger that is index finger and take your thumb and join together so it is a kind of a circle we make so this shape is known as circle so what is the spelling of circle c i r C L E circle. What is the spelling of circle? C I R C L E circle. Does circle have any side or corners? No. Circle do not have any corner. Circle do not have any sides. It is only like this around shape. So this is known as circle so right now when you are watching this video just identify three circle objects that are nearby you for example coin for example a circle plate for example a cap of your box a cap of your tin okay that is a circle shape so just look around and realize and find out what is the shape of that thing the second one is square the second shape is square s q u a r e square s q u a r e so how many sides of squares are here let's count one, two, three, four. Yes, that's correct. So four sides makes up the square. One, two, three, four. How many corners does a square have? The corners are over here. The the pink point one at the corner. One, two, three four so this shape is known as square that's correct okay moving on to the next one that is rectangle what is it known as rectangle r e c t a n g l e rectangle okay so here is the rectangle shape how you know this is rectangle so there is a big similarity and the difference between square and rectangle so first of all let's count the sides of rectangle one two three four how many sides of rectangle have four how many sides of square have four okay now what are the corners of rectangle one two three four correct so here we have four corners of rectangle so same there is a four corners of square four corners of rectangle four sides of square 
four sides of rectangle then what is the difference between square and rectangle so the difference is the length of the sides so here you see the square have four equal sides one two three four the four sides are equal in length they are equal to each other however when you go to the rectangle the sides of rectangles are not equal they are different if you see over here very long one side then again short side then again very long side and then again short side so that's the difference between the square and rectangle square have four equal sides rectangle have only two equal sides how two equal sides you see the shorter side matches the another shorter size and the longer side matches another longer side so how many two equal sides are here one two so one is the big one and the second is the short one so there are two equal sides in rectangle and square have how many sides four equal sides that's correct that's the difference coming up to the last one triangle so this was a rectangle and this is triangle t r i a n g l e triangle so what does the triangle means so tri means three what does it mean three so how many sides will be triangle having three that's correct so one two three so this is known as triangle so tri means three and the triangle have three sides and how many corners will be having one two three so triangle have three sides and three corners and it is in the shape of triangle so let's make a triangle with your fingers okay with your both hands join your index finger at the top and then join your thumb so it will be in the shape of triangle that's correct so what we learned today we have how many shapes four we have four main shapes that is circle in a round shape no sides no corners then we have square four sides and four corners and they are equal in length so the four sides are equal to each other then we have rectangle four sides four corner and two sides are equal so the two sides are equal to each other then we have triangle three sides and three corners and it is in the shape of pinpoint triangle so i hope you like this video so just look around you identify the shapes around you circle square rectangle and triangle so these are the four main basic shapes that are going to use in future but there are many more other shapes in the end of this video i leave one question for you what is the shape of earth so comment down what is the shape of earth see you in the next video bye bye